changing more than the clocks. Overnight, we will spring forward one hour for daylight saving time, which means it's also time to check those smoke detectors. Eric Pointer live telling us how one fire department has found a unique way to get their message out to the public. Firefighters here in Moraine are trying something new this year to help remind people to change the batteries on their smoke detectors and CO detectors. Firefighters say it's an important message that they try to get out around daylight saving time. It's that time of year. Time to spring your clocks forward. And firefighters are reminding people to change the batteries in their smoke and CO detectors. Make sure they're operational. They do save lives. Early detection is extremely important. Because we've had plenty of, uh, plenty of, of times where people have had detectors, their batteries don't work and the de detector doesn't work and they've had, tragic, uh, had, had a tragic effect. It's those tragic events the Moraine Fire Department is trying to prevent. So they're taking a new step this year. Lieutenant Gary Redding with the fire department told me this year they did what's called a code red message for people living in Moraine. We can pick a community and we can basically say we want to send this message out to all those in the community on their phones. We send the message or type in the message. That message gets automated and gets sent out to the residents to advise them of whatever we want to let them know about. He says they have been telling people to change their batteries during daylight saving time for a while. And this new method would hopefully get the message to more people. Well, as firefighters, we feel obligated for, for thinking safety, working, uh, working with the public to let them know about safety issues. And, and smoke detectors is just another one of those safety issues. Firefighters say you should check the batteries on your detectors at least once a month to make sure they're working properly. And if you have any questions about one of the detectors, you can call your local fire department. Reporting live in Moraine, Eric Pointer, 2 News, working for you.